Okay, guys. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to turn a Dell power supply from a uh, computer server into a power supply 12 volt for RC chargers. And these are the things you're going to need. So the navigator clips and wires. Two JSD male plugs. Now there's some pins in the back. They're going to have to jump. Pins one and two on the left bottom. And then the second pin up all the way over to the right. Those three you have to connect together. So simply plug these in to the bottom there. And take this JST and plug it into the bottom here. So you're going to connect both these wires and this top wire. Which I'll do that now. This is what's going to allow you to turn it on. Now you can either use an AC plug with this kind of uh, adapter on the end, or you can open it up by taking these screws, this side and this side. And the way to do this is there's a clip here, it's like a hammer that holds it. Slowly pull and push on the top, and there's a hinge. And it opens on a hinge. Now, you can't go through the back because you can see the fan and everything's in there. You can't get in there. But you can go from the front to the power if you don't want to use this jack. And this comes off with one more screw and you can solder into the two lead wires. Which is what I did here. This is the one I made. I filled this in with hot glue so you wouldn't get shocked. And I ran the power cable through the front. Now, the pins on the left, the three left pins are your ground, and the three right pins are 12 volts. Uh, I test this with a meter, I get 12.17 volts across all three pins, and it works out great. So if you do decide to bypass this jack, you can wire directly to these two wires inside. And when you do that, close it up, it just snaps in the front. Pop the screws in, and now what I would recommend is putting the alligator clips on these three, the right three being 12 volts, the left three being ground. And I would take this around here like I did on this one. And you're all set. This makes for a great 12 volt power supply for chargers, LED lights, uh, testing anything that runs on 12 volts. Make sure if you want to test servos and stuff, you get a 5 volt BEC. There is enough uh, there is certain pins, there's a link on RC groups that shows which pin you can have dual uh, fan speed control and there's 3.3 volts out and I think there might be a 5 to 6 volt out but I'm not sure on one of these pins. Uh, RC groups has a link I'll try to post it on this video. And that's it. Comment if you have any questions just ask and I'll get right back to you.